So today I've got quite a strange video for you, something that's really weird, a sacrifice. The sacrifice of Pyrocynical. Don't get ahead of yourself now, okay? Firstly, I just want to apologise if I sound kind of lethargic or sluggish in this video. I'm not feeling too great at the moment, I kind of woke up with a bit of a sore throat, so if I sound even more moany and miserable than I usually do, then again, I apologise for that. It's weird because, as a lot of you may know, when you get ill, you usually go through the process of being ill, and then the process of recovering and getting better. What I've got at the moment, it seems seems to just fucking blindside me out of nowhere, go away just as quick as it came, and then comes back again. It's probably not life-threatening. But anyway, so I digress from my possible future death, because today we've got quite an interesting video to talk about, and for once, guys, for once, Pyrocynical is not leeching off a trending topic. Can I, can I get a round of applause? Thank you. Thank you all so much. You're too kind. Today's video is a video actually about me, myself the great Pyrocynical, so I've devolved from leeching off trending topics to making videos on myself, essentially jerking myself off, so Pyrocynical can get worse, believe it or not. The video's titled Pyrocynical Sacrifice Ritual, he he's put at Pyrocynical hat, he really wants my attention, that's what he's trying to say, and on top of that as well, his watermark is actually the fucking Illuminati triangle, so possible cringe is on the radar, guys. How's it going, everyone? Attack helicopter here. <laughs> young Pyro, young Pyro. Don't get ahead of yourself now, okay? We don't want the, uh... The Lord and Savior, Billy Mays, coming down at the moment right now. Please, please, calm down. Okay, so, firstly, my friend, I got two main criticisms for you. Firstly, you made a Billy Mays joke in 2016. That shit died off in, like, 2010 in the fucking Gmod days, alright? Secondly, this is the highest quality this video goes. I'm- I'm not even joking. I didn't rip this off a shitty site. This is a complete HD conversion, so I could get it into Vegas, and the quality is still fucking abysmal. So, Jesus Christ, dude, if you're gonna roast Pyrocynical, at least dedicate a better camera than a fucking PNG webcam. Hello, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the show. Today, we got a special guest here, Pyro... Cynical here. Say hello. How's it going, everyone? All right, now... I love how the only sound file he uses is me saying, How's, how's it, it going, going everyone? everyone? Attack, Attack helicopter, helicopter here. here. Like, you think if he was going to make a Pyrocynical sacrifice video, he would have dedicated more time collecting the great vocabulary of a YouTuber such as myself. But no, he just uses seven fucking words I've said and nothing else. I don't want to get too far ahead of myself here, because we're on a mission here. We're going to be, uh, sacrificing our good foxy friend, Pyrocynical, the, to our lord and savior, Billy Mays. Oh, Billy, we miss you so. You see, another thing I'd like to point out as well, he says he's going to sacrifice me. Now, I'm pretty sure that sacrificial rituals that include or involve killing another human being is probably against the YouTube community guidelines. I'm pretty sure there's a guideline that says murder isn't allowed. You know, I'm just giving you a fair warning, dude. Bad things may or may not happen, and we don't want bad things to happen in here. We're trying to have a fun time. Now, we're going to move these over to the edge here because before ever it's a bit old Kool-Aid powder, so we're just going to get right into this spicy, uh... Spicy meme! Ah, uh, you see what he was trying to do there, guys? He was trying to plagiarize my joke. My joke where I say, uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to recreate it. I'm really fucking ill, but. <clears throat> Quite the spicy name. But yeah, he was trying to plagiarize that joke. I'm gonna fucking sue his ass after I'm done with this video. Alright, guys. Alright, now that we have our lines here, um, we're gonna take our dollar bill. Since we know we, we don't have much money here on the show. We don't have. We have barely any fucking money, okay? I need money. And money is very important, but- Okay, dude, we get it. You're broke as fuck and you need money. Hopefully, after this video, your channel will get some traction. You'll get a few more subs and views. Hell, you know what I'll do? 
I'll set up a fucking GoFundMe for you. A Patreon. Get all that money rolling in because you definitely deserve it. I have no idea who you are. You're about to apparently sacrifice me. And you're wearing a literal Satsuma on your head. So, you know, I'm more than willing to give you all of my YouTube earnings. So hopefully you'll be able to live a safe and comfortable life. Ingest the uh, Kool-Aid powder. Snap! <laughs> Oh. Oh, it's... Woo! Now, the word mental or insane is thrown around quite a lot, and it's lost its meaning because it's been horribly overused, mostly by me. But this individual here, he is the perfect example of someone who is genuinely fucking insane. I'm not too well at the moment. I'm trying to articulate and, you know, say my words properly. But this kid... He needs to be locked away, right? You lock him in a cell, you, you throw the cell into fucking Mount Doom from Lord of the Rings, right? I I'm doing that thing where I swear because I'm not saying anything creative, much like Leafy, but hear me out, right? This kid is not safe in society. Say hello, that's all we need him to do is say hello. After he says hello, we can move on with life and uh, sacrifice our good friend here. Hey, how you doing, buddy? You doing good? Fuck off. Thank God my sub- Of course you're doing good. <laughs> okay, to be fair, that was pretty funny. But only because he took my words out of context. A apart from that, bad video. And to be honest, if I actually was spread across the table and ready to be sacrificed, I probably would still tell him to fuck off. So, that little skit he made there, that was actually really accurate. Today, you're gonna be sacrificed to our Lord and Savior. I already said it three times now. I don't need to say it again. All right, Pyro, we really love you, okay? I want you to know that. You're a really beautiful creature, but you, you, we, need, we need your sins. Or your sins really need to be wiped away so you can help every single person on this earth. You're our new lord. You're our new savior. Holy shit, boys. He got himself a karambe. Looks like a rust coat. I don't know how it rolls in America, but sometimes in the UK, you've got to give like a reason why you need a weapon, like a knife or something. I'd imagine if this kid lived in the UK, he'd probably write something along the lines of to sacrifice a YouTuber. And then the police would probably go to his house and arrest him. Y yeah. In the societal track of humanity. Hocus pocus, laka 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 ding, laka 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 ding, woo woo woo. You see, I, I said that as a joke, but he does actually have a fucking CSGO knife. Jesus Christ, alright. I, I got a few CSGO knives, alright, but the fact that you're showing it in a video, god damn boy, get yourself some sunlight. So I just found this new knife site, it's called Elemental Knives. It's not working. Oh yeah, father. Father, feel the pain of yesterday. Yes, father. You know, I just want to give you a little heads up here, dude. When you're banging the desk trying to kill me, could you maybe have the microphone not on the same desk? Because there's this horrible fucking reverb like I'm watching a Transformers trailer. There's so much bass, it's like I'm at a Skrillex concert. Just, just... Get get a stand, a little a little road stand, you know. Really, just upgrade your channel quality. Ooh, yeah, Father. Sacrifice your sins. Sacrifice your sins, Father. Yes, yes. Father, Father, you've been really great lately. I get that it's a toy animal and not like a real one, but. I swear one of the first signs of being a serial killer is torturing and killing small animals. So chances are this kid you're going to see on wanted posters in a few weeks. It always starts off with the stuffed animals, then then the stuffed dolls, and then real people. That that's usually the pyramid of hierarchy. He died for our sins everyone. He died for us who we are as people here. He's dead now, but he's not forgotten. He will never be forgotten in our eyes. The thing is, you tried to make this comparison that I'm like Christ, I was sacrificed, crucified to cleanse the sins of the world, but honestly, the only thing my death has benefited is your channel, and this video itself has 88 views. I know that he's gone guys, but his sins must have been wiped off this earth or else. It's the 1 million subscriber video. Hey guys, PC13 Jet Engine here. Thank you so much for 1 million subscribers. Here is my face of you, because, uh, you know, it's been like six months. That is actually my face. I, I have no idea how he got hold of this image. Please contact this man. I don't know how he got hold of that image.
Don't kill yourself. And that's the end of the video. I, I, I really don't know what to say about it. It's a retarded video from someone who hopefully dies by the end of next week. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I know it wasn't the most, like, intense video I've done. It was a pretty wank video, honestly, but I feel like total shit. I haven't uploaded in, like, two days, so I have to get something out for you guys or my channel will fucking plummet. I'm pretty much at the point now I'm either gonna wake up tomorrow feeling better or I'm, I'll, I'll die. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Two people that made this video possible. Thanks a lot to RazQ for the thumbnail and the intro video as well. And thanks to this retard who, you know, I, I'll link a channel in the description. You should check him out, probably. Anyways, guys, thanks a lot for the memes. I'll see you all tomorrow. Hopefully, if I'm, if I'm not dead. Well, Keemstar says that actually HRH told them that he has a bunch of bombs on Leafy and Pyrocynical that are going to come out very soon. So apparently we're going to see exposed videos on Leafy and Pyrocynical soon. <laughs> what a story, Mark. Bitch, niggas. Nobody can touch my swag. Nobody can do with my swag. Nobody can touch my swag. Nobody can... Nobody can, nobody can touch my swag Nobody can do with my swag Nobody can touch my swag